Swakopmund has repeatedly won praise for being a clean town by international tourists. To complement this image, the municipality has made various efforts to promote green initiatives. The latest addition is the Green Environmental Project, which hopes to unite all environmental clubs in Swakopmund. A project committee member, Paolo Samuel, noted that there are not many active environmental clubs at Swakopmund, and as a result, environmental issues do not get the attention they deserve. If we unbalance nature, humankind will suffer. Furthermore, as people alive today, we must consider future gen generations. He noted that the project would increase focus on the clubs formed at various schools so that pupils were educated through practical lessons about conservation. Samuel was confident that by educating the children, influencing their parents to adopt greener waste and recycling waste material would also be easy. The regional governor emphasized the need for green parks and further observed that residential areas like Mundessa and the Democratic Resettlement Community, or DRC, have parks that require some improvement. Those are very simple things. They are so educational. They will help our, our children to know the environment. Uh, it will help a child in, in a DRC to know that, oh, Grass can be grown here, it can be green, or something green is very good, and so on. In addition to other projects, the Swakupmund municipality plans to open an $18 million recycling facility to ensure a cleaner town and surroundings.